All right, today being Earth Day, we've got a great project for everyone here today. And uh, we're gonna find ways to either recycle or upcycle those awesome soap containers you get every time you buy uh, Maple Hill Natural Soap. So today we've got Emily and we've got uh, Claire here who are gonna show us some uh, great ways that we can uh, reuse uh, those soap containers that we send out that are made from 100% recycled uh, paper material. So today we're gonna be planting some pumpkin seeds, getting the garden ready for uh, this summer and fall. And uh, let's go ahead and uh, plant some seeds, girls. So go ahead, the first thing we wanna do is put some soil uh, in those containers. So we fill up each side of the container. Um, so putting the soil in there. And you want to make sure you fill it up to the top there, so you get soil all the way to the top. We'll help clear out here a little bit. Yep, and then you want to fill the other side as well, so you get both sides filled with dirt. And we're just using regular organic potting soil here that you can find anywhere if you make your own. It's awesome too. All right, so we got those filled with soil. Yeah. All right, so the next thing we wanna do is plant our seeds. So we've got pumpkins here today. So uh, we're gonna have those for Halloween this year. So now what we wanna do with these particular seeds is just go ahead and put four holes where you wanna plant the seeds. Yep, and once you've got your holes, go ahead and drop your seeds in those holes. Oh, yeah. All right, now you want to sprinkle some uh, soil over the top of those seeds and make sure they're good and covered. And this is a great alternative to those plastic seed starters you find in the store. It's something you've already got in your house probably from the soap you've got from us. Uh, and it, it decomposes, it, it biodegrades uh, right in the garden. Or if you have a compost pile, you just throw the soap boxes in there afterwards. All right, so now what you wanna do is go ahead and uh, sprinkle some uh, water on there. We've got a spray bottle we're gonna use just to make it a little easier to do. And you want to make sure the soil is uh, nice and moist for those seeds to get started. All right. And then once it's uh, good and moist and we've got all the seeds in there, uh, what we do is we take a piece of uh, plastic saran wrap and you can just lay it over the top there. And this will create a nice little greenhouse effect for the seeds and you can just wrap it around the sides there so it tucks under. And depending on the seeds you plant, um, it could take anywhere from you know, three or four days to a little over a week for them to start to germinate and sprout. Um, I'd say once the plant starts to touch the top of the uh, cellophane or the plastic wrap, uh, you wanna take the plastic wrap off um, and then just make sure you, you keep the soil moist and damp each day. And then you can uh, plant those seeds uh, or those uh, seedlings in the garden uh, and get a head start on the season. So that's just a little tip here for uh, Earth Day. Thought we'd share with you guys and uh, hope you enjoy.